सी एस थ्री फोर फाइव वन इंट्रोडक्शन टू आपरेटिंग सिस्टम द टापिक इज पेज रीप्लेसमेंट अलगार दम प्रसेंटेड बै अनुज आर एपी सी एस रोहिणी कालेज आफ् इंजीनियरी अंड टेक्नजी पेज रीप्लेसमेंट अलगार दम पेज रीप्लेसमेंट अलगार दम इज यूज वेन अ पेज फॉल्ट अकर् पेज फॉल्ट मीन द पेज रेफरस बै दी पी यू इज नाट प्रसन्न इन द मेन मेमरी when the cpu generates the reference of a page if there is any vacant frame available in the main memory then the page is loaded in that vacant frame the page replacement algorithm is used to decide which page will be replaced to allocate memory to the current reference page the first one is first in first out page replacement algorithm this algorithm is similar to the operations of the queue all the pages are stored in the queue in the order they are allocated frames in the main memory the one which is allocated first stays in the front of the queue then another one which is allocated the main memory first is replaced first then the one which is at the front of the queue is removed at the time of replacement the following example consider the page is referenced by the cpu in in the order or 678967167891 here these are the pages here we are taken about three frames that is frame 1 2 and 3 so as the above figure let there are three frames in the memory the 6 7 8 are allocated to the vacant slot as they are not in memory when 9 comes pages fault occurs it replaces 6 which is the oldest in memory or front element of the queue then the 6 comes it replaces 7 which is the oldest pages memory now similarly 7 replaces 8 1 replaces 9 then 6 comes which is already in memory so in this situation the page is hit then the 7 comes it's also the page is hit then we can replace uh, 8 and 6 and 9 also replace to 7 then 1 comes the page is hit otherwise the page is miss the number of page fault is equal to 9 while using the first in first out algorithm the number of pages fault increases by increasing the number of frames this phenomenon is called a bloody anomaly algorithm let's take the same above order of the page with the four frames so here also we have taken about four frames and insert the values in this above ex picture we can show that it can be seen that the number of page fault is 10 there were 9 page fault with 3 frames and 10 page fault with 4 frames the number of pages fault increase by increasing the number of frames then optimal page replacement in this algorithm the page which would be used after the longest interval is replaced in other words the page which is in the fourth to come to the upcoming sequence is replaced consider the following example here also the pages are there we have taken about three frames uh, first the value 6 6 is inserted into frame 1 and 7 inserted into frame 2 and 8 inserted into frame 3 the next value is 6 6 is already available in the particular frame so this is catch miss the next one is 7 7 is also also Uh, inserted into the frame so here uh, the catch is hit so first all the frames are empty that is 6 7 8 are allocated to the frames that is page fault now 9 comes and replace 8 as it is the furthest in upcoming sequence 6 and 7 would come earlier then that so not replaced then 6 comes which is already present so which is already present means it is a page hit then 7 comes it is also the page hit then 1 replace 9 similarly it is a page fault then 6 comes it is page hit and also 7 comes here also page is hit then 8 replace 6 here also page fault 
and 9 replaced to 8 is also page fault then 1 7 9 comes respectively which are already present in the memory so uh, 6 replace 9 here the page is fault it can also replace 7 and 1 as no other pages present in the upcoming sequence here the number of page fault is equal to 8 this is the most optimal algorithm but is impractical because it is impossible to predict the upcoming page references. The next one is least recently used. This algorithm works on previous data. The page which is used the earliest is replaced or which appear the earliest in the sequence is replaced. Consider the same example. First, all the frames are empty that is 6, 7, 8 are allocated in the frames that is 6, 7, 8 are allocated in the frames that is the page fault now 9 comes and replace 6 which is used to the earliest here also the page is fault then 6 replace 7, 7 replace 8 and 1 replace 9 here these 3 frames are page fault then 6 comes which is already present already present means page is hit then 7 comes here also page is hit then 8 replace 1 9 replace 6 1 replace 7 and 7 replace 8 here the page is fault then 9 comes 9 comes means the page is hit then 6 replace 1 so here the page is fault so the total number of page fault is equal to 12 Thank you.